as you said to. Johnny, where are we today? Hey, have you seen that squirrel? I reckon we're going to get close to it here. Where are we then, Johnny? <laughs> we're at Stanford, but apparently it's a nature site. And we're here today, we're going to uh, go on a little road trip. We're going to go around to a number of different football fun camps. We're kicking off today at Stanford Mount Fitchett. It's nice and close to my house, which is a great start to the day. Uh, we're going to go see super star head coach Harvey. We're going to have loads of fun. We're going to see loads of kids diving around on our football inflatables, and it's going to be a great day. I know what you're thinking. Uh, the uh, gilet shorts combo doesn't really go well I'm trying to bring it back guys hey whose drink is that Mama. that is literally twice the size of your head drink. that's yours no hey no that's my mum's drink this is my dad's drink <laughs> your favorite thing about football is running yeah you get exercise you get exercise nice Who's your sport, Eddie? United. United? You've got Spain shorts on, I can see. So, Harvey is an absolute legend, as you can see behind me. Harvey first heard about the FFF through one of my friends. Um, shout out to Iona. She shared uh, the Football Fun Factory page. She shared one of my posts, and Harvey then saw the FFF. He then, previously, before joining us, uh, worked at Tesco. He saw the opportunity to become a head coach, to make a difference in his local community of Stansted and Bishop Stortford, and was desperate and determined to come on board. So what he did is he worked extra shifts, he worked extra hard to save money so he could invest it into the Football Farm Factory franchise. He then became a head coach. He is now living his best life. He's got loads of kids behind me taking part in one of his football fun camps. He has 40 children attending his one hour session on a Monday evening just down the road. He is driving around in his FFF van and he is loving it. Um, it's so great to see someone that's such a brilliant bloke, such a brilliant man. Um, yeah, absolutely smashing it in his community. I am next. Get in. Come on, high fives. Yes, man, get up. Hey. What a way to finish with a worldly goal. Get in. The road trip continue, continues? Continues. The road trip continues. Next stop, Sawston Village College and superstar head coach Dave Casado. Here we are at Sawston. This, believe it or not, was the first ever place I delivered my first ever, ever, football fun factory session. So before joining the FFF, I worked at Cambridge United for just under a decade, uh, doing a number of different roles. And then I met with James, he told me all about the football fun factory and I was desperate to come on board. So I joined the FFF as a franchisee and this was my community, Sawston. So I launched the FFF here, did my, one of my first ever sessions here with James, a um, number of years ago now, three, four years ago. Um, and then as the organization grew across East Anglia, Cambridge and across the UK, um, unfortunately I had to step away from my community and find a coach to come in and take over my franchise and lead my community. And then we met Dave, superstar head coach Dave, who now runs the community in Sawston, Linton and Trumpington. He is unbelievable. You're going to go see him in a minute um, in action. He is a fantastic coach. There was no one I would rather have take over my community and carry on the, the sort of work I'd done as a franchisee. Here he is now, sporting his brand new gilet. Ho, ho, ho. Good morning. How are we doing? Good to see you, Brett. And you, bud. Bring it in, Dave. All right, Ollie. How are you? <laughs> Thank you. Don't film this. It's a serious conversation. Uh, so we're going to head outside for a little bit. The kids are just playing on the inflatables, so we don't want to disrupt their day. So we're going to go outside now. We're going to film a few tickies, tiki tockies, TikToks, um, and. Uh, and then we'll head back inside, we'll grab a group and we'll do a coaching session out on the Astro Turf in a bit, but yeah, TikTok tonight. AJ Tracy live and direct. Don't know anymore, Ollie. Looking back on when we first met, 
I cannot escape and I cannot forget. <laughs> I'm on fire! Coaching mistakes. Football coaches, when you put out cones, walk backwards. And then you can make sure that you always stay in a straight line. Dave is just going to bring a group of children out and we're going to do a couple of coaching sessions. We're going to play a couple of matches and we're going to have loads of fun. Today, I've got some pesto pasta, um, but the only pasta we had were these like massive shells. I'll show you in a bit. Um, it's pretty crazy, really. Right, would everyone like to put their stuff down in the magical circles wow. over here? Ah, oh, cheers, Hugo. And freeze there. Who's the stillest? Well, I'm going to give you a special rule that you don't have to make a pass in, you can do a dribble in. What happens? What happens when you stretch an elastic band? Before that, you don't let go. It gets bigger. It gets bigger. Brilliant. Right, so when you have. Saka. Saka, why do you love Saka? Because he scores goals. Ah, thank you, Skylar. Thank you for being so helpful. You did it all the way over here by yourself. Can I get a high five for that? That is amazing. What a superstar for being so helpful. It's so, so nice of you. We'll leave that one out if that's okay. Uh, yeah, mate, it's been class. The kids are um, brilliant here at Sawston. There's lots of familiar faces that either I've coached before in the past, so it's great to see them all. It's been great. The sun even came out for a little bit. Um, so all in all, pretty good. We're just going to head uh, say goodbye to everyone. We're going to head over to Camborne and see superstar Andy Killick uh, in action. Straight in his face. That's what I was aiming for. God, it's roasting in here. I've got the gilet on. I've always set the gilet off. Amborne. Entering Amborne. Here we are then, okay. Just coming into Camborne to go and see super Andy Killick, Camborne Village College, where he runs his football fun camps. Just going past the uh, BMW mini garage. There it is, the Holy Grail, Camborne Village College. Hello, Johnny speaking. Just got off a call with Sweden. Set up a meeting for next Wednesday. It's always fast paced at the FFF. Now I'm going to eat my lunch. Oh. Told you they were big. Look at the size of those shells. Same size as my head. Here we are, Camborne Village College. Hey! How are you? Good to see you, pal. Your hands cool, yeah? Yeah, I know. Ollie makes me carry all his stuff. <laughs> How are you, pal? Yeah, I'm all right. How are you? Yeah, good, thanks, mate. Merci, Pugu. I know what you're thinking. Is he going to do the whole lesson in French? But I'm not. Ah, oh, well played. You're just like this superstar who tackles someone and wants... Guess how old you think I am? You had to guess. 27. 27, thank you very much. I'm actually 30 years old. I'm still angry. And? Winning! Juice, if you could say anything to the whole world about football, what would you say? I love football. See you, Andy. Uh, yeah, another great trip uh, over to another great football fun camp. We're just leaving Campbell and we're going to head back to Sawston, pick up your car okay, uh, and then finish off the day. But it's been a great day. The camp over here was great. It was great to go out on the AstroTurf. Uh, and do a couple of sessions out there and chat to some of the kids uh, and now just have a little break and then they're gonna uh, have a little go on the inflatables to finish but yeah it's been a great 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 day a great great Camborne great Camborne back at the office back at the beautiful football fun factory HQ as you can see behind me the lambs are out in full force you've got some little cows over there as well uh, so it's nice to be back, but it's been a brilliant day. We're now going to go in, catch up with a bit of admin. Uh, Ollie's going to whiz together a few videos and, uh, yeah, caps off what has been a glorious day in May half term. <laughs>